Welcome. Today we will be going over the usage of the GSA Advantage event search feature. There are three ways to search on GSA Advantage. You may use the keyword search, which is used when you type in a keyword, part number, NSN, or contract number in the search box. When using keyword search, it is better to search for the exact printer you're looking for rather than only typing printer, as that will result in thousands of items containing the word printer. To browse by category, you can browse by products, services, or special programs, then click on the item that best fits what you're searching for. Lastly, what we will be discussing today is the advanced search feature. The advanced search feature allows you to search for an exact phrase in a particular product or service field or restrict your search by category, price, minimal order amount, or socioeconomic factors and limit your display options. Before we review how to use the advanced search feature, some tips to keep in mind when searching Advantage are to enter the keywords that best describe what you're looking for. Also, enter specific data such as NSNs, part numbers, or vendor contract numbers. Also, keep in mind when you enter two or more search keywords, the search results with items that only contain all the keywords in your query. Lastly, remember to restrict your keyword search to a specific category, such as IT solutions and electronics, to narrow down your search. Now let's begin. This is the welcome page on GSA Advantage. In the top bar, we are able to click the advanced search button. Let's click the advanced search button. From there, Several search options are available to search for an item. The drop down menu lists three options. One is to search for any of the words. This will search for any of the words we type in the find box. This is not the preferred method unless you do not have an exact description of your item, as this can result in a long list of items. Next, we have one to search for all the words. This will search for all the words we entered in the find box. For an example, if we were to type first aid sign, all three words of first aid and sign must be found in the title or the description of the item for it to match. This is the preferred method if you have an idea of what you're looking for. Lastly, the exact phrase option is the most precise way to search when you know specifically what you're looking for, as it filters only to show words that are an exact match for what you input in the find box. You can also determine where you want to look for the keywords you entered by selecting the options from the search in drop down menu. This option allows you to determine where you want the system to search in, such as any product field, any particular NSN, or contractor name, to name a few. There are also ways to add stipulations to your searches by clicking the More Terms button. You can add up to 10 stipulations by adding ands to narrow down your search further. If you add too many, you can take them away by selecting the fewer terms button to take them away one by one. Or you can select start over to take them away all at once. You can also select display options for your search results. You can select categories displaying the many categories we have. You can select how you want your results to be sorted. You can select how many items you want displayed per page and any minimum order amounts you want stipulated as well. 
You can also include a price range of where you want the system to search within. You can also select whether you only want to see items with photos by clicking the show only items with photos box. If you want to see items that include shipping costs, you can click the show only items that include shipping costs box. Lastly, you can limit your search by multiple social program and initiatives and socioeconomic factors and sources by clicking the different programs corresponding boxes. If you wish to learn further about each, you can click their hyperlinks to learn more. When you are ready to search, you can scroll to the bottom of the page and click the search button or there's an option at the top of the page as well to click search. This concludes our session today on how to use the GSA Advantage Advanced Search feature. Thank you.